Alright, this is just a uh, quick video uh, about this torque dampener that I installed here. Uh, pop this off real quick. Alright. So basically, what I did was I got a hole in here to mount this side, just a straight bar, and then I welded two pieces coming straight down um, so I can put this bolt through. You can see there. And this is just a shock absorber from like some go pet or something scooter thing that uh, I had when I was a kid. Um, so I just found that in the garage. And then I welded up this bracket here. And what I did was I, I removed the sound resonator uh, pipe and I capped it off back here and removed the housing. Then relocated this piece from over here back over to here. And then of course I, I fabricated this bracket and then um, bolted it here and here. Uh, of course I had already welded the tabs in at that point. <coughs> and then it was just kind of redoing the hosing. So with this piece I still use the bottom hose but essentially what I did was I ended up swapping this hose in and angling it differently. Um, it was already pre-bent and everything so it was pretty simple, pretty straightforward. Um, just swapping around some hoses uh, and got everything squared up. And with it, I mean, I feel a lot better shifts. Um, just it, it goes into gear much, much better. Um, it's just it really has improved the driving of the car, um, and it just keeps the engine movement down. Now this spring is actually from the wastegate, uh, 14 psi wastegate spring out of an SRT4. Um, I upgraded the spring in that, so that's just uh, the stock spring there. Um, so. That's pretty much it. Um, basically, I just I wasn't sure if I wanted to get engine mounts yet or not, um, so I just fabricated this up so I didn't have to worry about having any sort of issues with the uh, the motor bouts being too aggressive. So, just kind of uh, keeping it simple and straightforward. So I have all the drivability with this, but of course, under hard loading, it's going to uh, to dampen the movement and keep the engine much much more uh, stable. And, uh, I mean, of course, this is supposed to compress and everything. It just keeps the engine a lot more in its place. Get a little bit of movement, but nothing too bad. All right, well, that pretty much just sums up that. Um, I mean, probably, I mean, it didn't even cost me anything. I just all scrap stuff I found in the garage. So uh, it could be pretty cheap and pretty easy to do. So, all right, well, hopefully you all have an idea. Let me know what you think. Uh, if you hate it, if you love it, if you want to learn how to do it on your own. So, alright, just let me know.